Hello, Marsha. Thank you for joining us. Joining us. Hope everybody's doing okay. Please uh, leave a leave a comment so I know that you're watching, and let me know where you're watching from. Welcome, welcome. I'm gonna wait a few seconds to let everybody um, get their no notification. And hello, Wanda. Let me adjust my thing here. Okay. So for those of you that have not seen any of this or you're just logging in today, um, this is Monica Gioberti with Stamping with Monica. And this is my 2022 to 2023 new annual catalog virtual catalog kickoff party i started uh, doing video this morning we started at 11 o'clock this morning and uh between this is my live video number four and then um if you missed any of the previous videos or posts they are all in, on my page and uh, you can always go back and watch them because they're going to stay on the page if you see a red box that says live, it means that you're watching live. And I thank you very much for joining in. And uh, in this part, in this video, we're going to do a little bit of um, crafting with ink colors. I posted a few um, um, video. Uh, there's There should have been a video posted on my page talking about the new, introducing the new in color and that in colors and that was from stamping up i like the fact that they provide us with uh tools to share and i appreciate everybody that is um, popping on and sharing my video okay so let's talk about in colors like you don't know any of them right uh all of the demonstrators have been um, showing the ink colors because I personally think that these are um, one of the best ink colors or the combination of ink colors that they have um, released. Um, but what can I say? Every time I say that they're the best because um, the one that just retired, I love them all. So it's like crazy. So we are enjoying these new ink colors for the next two years. So this year and next year. So these will be um, retiring in 2024. And so we're trying to get the best out of them, right? Use them as much as we can. So these are the names of the colors. And I put the um, stack of the ink pads in, um, I think it is, alphabetical order not that i will keep them in alphabetical order but that's just to show you and to show you how um um the range of color is is great so i am going to show you what is included if you don't know already what's included in this year's ink color collection so we have the ink pads we have the ink call ink refills okay and i suggest if you're buying an ink pad i suggest to get the uh, coordinating re-anchor then we have a pack of the stamping bright markers these are water-based ink uh, writing markers okay you can write and you can color because they have a fine tip and a brush tip then we have the stamping blends and these are the um, alcohol based um, markers call them that way okay and then we have as far as embellishment we have sparkly ribbon and they all coordinate with, coordinate with the ink colors. We have a pack of Baker's Twine. And I love it. I love all the five colors in there. We have 
obviously our um, pack of cardstock. You can select the individual packs or you can select an assortment of the colors to start with and you get five sheets of each color. Actually, take it back four sheets of the five colors because it's 20 sheets so you get four sheets of each one and you can get it also in the 12 by 12 if you're a scrapbooker also in the 12 by 12 car stock okay same assortment this is the only way that you can get the 12 by 12 and then we have the designer series paper this is a pack of 40 sheets you get 10 sheets um, for each, 8 sheets for 5 colors. The 8 times 5 equals 40, right? And then we have the um, glimmer paper. Same, we have 20 sheets, so 4 sheets per color. Okay? So a lot of uh, product this year they have a lot of progress plus more plus there is more that coordinates with the ink calls but this is what we could consider the collection okay and then so that is that and then i just want to quickly do a, a quick comparison for some of the colors that i found uh could be um, having, you know, people will say, oh, by the way, they look exactly the same as the colors that we already have, but that is not true. Nothing matches the line of colors that we already have. These are unique colors, and there's nothing that matches. So let's say, for example, we're going to grab, um, hmm, I'm going to start with our parakeet right here parakeet party you know from the first look you think that that might look like granny apple green but it doesn't because to me granny apple green it's more of a, a darker green look at looking at this i could say oh it looks like old olive this one but it's not so uh, parakeet party it's very very different and even very, very different from previous car stock that we they were part of the ink colors that retired a long time ago. The other one that we might have a little doubt about, so this, which color do you think this is? This is our Poppy Parade, okay? And this is our Sweet Sorbet. There's a huge difference. A huge difference. This is more of a brighter color than this. And maybe my um, light lighting is not the best and because it's in the cello, but as you can see, they're not the same at all. They're similar, but I think they work the same. I mean, you can use them for that, okay? And then... I have, okay, the one that we can compare. So let's say that we have Starry Sky. It's very different from our Night of Navy. Or even the Misty Moonlight that just retired. They're so, so, so different. So, so different. But look, they could go well together. And then let me grab another color that I thought, and that will be, do I already have it out to show you? And this is our Pacific Point. So very different, but you see the different um, tone of our blues. Maybe if I take it out from here, you can see better. Okay, in our, the color here. So you can see it outside. So this is our starry, 
starry sky or actually this is orchid oasis oh no it's not no 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 this is my starry sky okay so there you go so you have a bit of a comparison of the colors and i think they all all work well together another set of products that um another product that coordinates with them are the new t boutique cards and envelopes this is a set of cards and envelopes um with all the ink colors you get four each four for each color okay so these are i'm gonna open them up because a lot of this stuff i just got it in so let me open this one up and show you and this is a easy way to be crafting because everything is done for you so this is what they look like if you haven't seen them so pair kit and this is let me just loosen this one up a bit okay So that's your card base and your envelope in parakeet and then we have in sweet sorbet so this is another and I like the fact that they have different patterns look at that so this is striped this is polka dotted and then we have another polka dotted for your parakeet it's just gorgeous i mean making cards with these it will be like quick and easy right and then this is solid oh this is our orchid oasis and this is how the pattern is so orchid oasis like so four and then last but not least I like the gingham and let me find the envelope right there so fun and so beautiful and all it is a good solid you know car stock and everything so these are the other element or the products that coordinate with the ink colors okay a few notes about the ink colors um, from Stampin' Up! during the month of May. Yes, they are very pretty. They are very pretty. So, this is our Orchid Oasis, like so. See, the, um, the ink pad, the outside, it could be tricky, you know, deceiving a bit. And this is our Parakeet Party. This is Story Sky. Look how beautiful. This is our Sweet Sorbet. And this is our Tahitian, Tahitian Tide. Tahitian, Tahitian Tides. Tide. Okay. And then what else I was going to tell you? Well, you all know since I, th I think most of you are stamping up demonstrators here or happy discount shoppers like i call i define uh myself is that stamping up is offering a special on the starter kit it's color it's called in color starter kit and it will be only during the month of may and what it's a promotion tied to the starter kit so basically uh we know that the starter kit is a hundred um is ninety nine dollars you select up to hundred and twenty five dollars pay no shipping just tax in whichever state um you be in and stamping up is adding some uh, free products and that will be the in color car stock okay and that will be the assortment because i have here and i can check the numbers where is here because i have it one five nine 
two of four. So this is it will be a pack of the assorted cardstock. It will be a whole set of ink pads. The designer series paper, the ink color, the pack of the designer series paper that I showed you right here and then a pack of in in color grip paper all of this will be free and the value is sixty six dollars and fifty cents so if you do the math um plus you get a paper pumpkin box for free some um you know business supplies like catalogs that kind of stuff so i think doing the math you pay $99 plus tax and you receive over $200 in product. I think this is a great deal. So now either you are, um, you know, one, I would love to have anybody, you know, that is interested to join our Happy Basement Stampers. Or if you have your own demonstrator, contact them because this is a great deal and there are no no obligation whatsoever you do whatever you want with your starter kit nobody's gonna come to you and say oh by the way time is up you haven't done anything with it so please return everything no because it's not a starter starter kit on its itself it's whatever you want to order whatever you would like to have as part of your crafting supplies okay and that's it then the other thing that I personally I am offering and I already filled out uh, the spots but if anybody is interested I am still accepting um, um, spot you know people into my ink color club so if you're interested contact me it's a way for you to collect all the new products into the in new ink colors on a budget over the five months period of may through september the cost is 48 dollars a month if it is porch pickup or 56 if it is shipped to you and what you get every month you get your ink pad the refill the combo of the blends one marker then you receive um, eight ink color car bases car stock you will receive the the color the um, eight sheets of the uh, ink color designer series paper the four sheets of the glimmer paper metallic ribbon and a spool of the baker's twine plus more stuff from me as my thank you if uh, we'll post it here again if anybody's interested um, I'll be happy to help you out set up everything so after that let's go ahead and craft okay this card will be part of the group of cards that you can get for free with my ordering special and I will post it and stay tuned because I will post um, a little flyer with it with all the details and um, so you can get into the deal also because May is the month of my stamp anniversary, whatever you call it and so I want to thank everybody that is helping me and that has helped me throughout the years and also you know with your orders you get something for free from me okay so we are going to start with our project I'm not gonna take too much or too long for this one and let me go and start so these are the bits and pieces and I'm trying to keep the design simples for these because I want if you're getting the cards for free with your minimum order, then I want you to be able to craft without getting frustrated. The only thing that you will have to provide is your stamp, ink, and adhesive because everything would be already cut for you. So the designs for these cards are very simple, okay? Because I need you to be able to craft. So this is a card base Car base of Tahitian Thai, the 
okay and fold it in half simple and easy using bone folders bone folder right here set it aside then we have a piece of basic white that measures four by three and three-fourth okay then we have a strip of one and a half by four of the T Boutique Designer Series paper. I have the video posted. I went through all the patterns in the paper. And this, yes, it is included in the T Boutique suite, but it also has lots of the colors of the new in colors. So I chose this pattern for this card. Then obviously, um, depending on you know the number of people that are getting your my your um what you may call it pattern might be a little bit different from mine but will you'll get all the supplies and then i have this little label that i die cut it from the standalone set of dies called fabulous frames dies and i liked this little uh, label here so i used that and we're using the Sweet Song, Songbirds stamp set and punch to create the card, okay? As well as the Glossy Dots assortment that, are, that I used already in my first project. So you're getting a little bit of a hint. This could be one of the projects that you can get, um, products that you can get for free with a qualifying order, okay? So... Here we go, let's get on with the stamping. And I'm gonna go down this way. I'm gonna, I have all my stamps ready out there. I'm gonna take the first stamp. Oops, let me just do this. Cause I want this one to be right here. For reverb. Okay, and I'm going to start stamping. I have everything. I'm going to need my crumb cake right here, and I'm going to grab this. So this is photopolymer, and you know that when you get him, it's like that, but then you can just take them out and stick them, take them out of the clear there and stick them directly on the stamp case so you know that you have all of the stamps okay so i'm going to ink in crumb cake this is so fun i love the fact that stamping up is coming out with all these creatures i'm gonna check if yes stamping the right way and i'm gonna stay like so Okay, and let's not forget that we need our piercing tool, piercing tool, piercing mat. Then I'm going to take my parakeet party and take the leaves. And the leaves are all together, the stamp, but they're built in a way that you'll be able to create voila okay set this aside thank you for sharing ladies remember to fill out the door prize form if you want to get enter into the door prize drawing so you fill out the form first and then when i see that you fill out the form i go back and check your comments i go back and check your sharing and i go back and then if you get um, whoever places in orders that is in the door prize list, then they can get more entries. Okay, then we're going to take the little flower right here. And we're going to use our sweet sorbet. And we're going to stamp the flowers. I love these colors together. They're really bright voila that is done okay 
So put this to the side. And now, this one is done for now. Or no, we can do this. We're going to grab our notes that are part of the stamp set. And we're going to stamp kind of like so. I don't remember when I studied music. I hope I'm, I'm, I'm doing it the correct way. Okay. And then we're going to grab our bird and we're choosing this bird. And this is the one that matches the punch, as you can see. Okay. The little one. It's too small, I think, yes, to be punched out, but you can fussy cut the, the large one. That would be this one. You're go we're going to stamp it. And now I'm using the Tahitian Tide. Okay. And grabbing a scrap of paper that I should have had somewhere. Where did I put it? Oh, well, let, let me go get a piece of scrap paper. Like I have a bazillion. Okay. And we're going to stamp the bird. Like so. Okay, so now, do you see this, right? The bubbling... It's because they are super, super duper juicy. So I'm going to move the ink all to one side. Okay, try to move everything to one side. See how much ink comes off there because they're very, very... Hello, Cynthia. Nice to see you popping on. So let's see if our... Yeah, it's a little bit better. But still, very juicy. So let's try if it is a bit better. Kind of, we'll take it. I need to... Uh, a way for you to do it is I'll scrape it away or take paper towels and absorb a bunch of ink off of it. These are just brand new, so that's why they do it this way okay now I'm gonna take eyes the stamp set has let me show it to you in case you don't have this one so you have two birds little feet these are the wings then you have the, the uh, leaves the trunk um, this looks like a little palette or whatever a bunch of sentiments that I love because they cover all the occasions welcome congratulations something to celebrate um, thank you special day then we have eyes two set of eyes mus music notes this is the bird beak bird speak and this is the nest okay so now I chose these little eyes this one is whistling with eyes closed and then this is the beak and I'm using crushed curry for the beak and then we're just gonna go try to match there and we're done oops sorry you saw my head I'm so sorry And now we're punching. Let's see if this is going to fit right there. Watch the tail. Trying to, okay, gotta see what I'm doing. Sorry, ladies. I gotta see what I'm doing. Oh, I know what's happening. This little corner here is in the way. And here we go. Watch the tail. 
and then come up here. Why can't I punch when I did my thing? It came out so nice and easy. Oh, got to turn it a bit. Oh, got it. Voila. Okay. This is done. Sorry, it took this long. Okay, and then I can start. Oh, we have to stamp the sentiment. The sentiment in black on our little label. And this says, we're going to grab this one because I want to see if it makes a difference on here. I'm going to stamp a little note of things. And voila. Oh, so cute. I like these colors. If you've been around a while, this car stock could look like, you know, tempting turquoise. But because uh, I don't think I have any more, I wanted to compare. But it doesn't because tempting turquoise, it's a lot lighter. Okay, so now I'm going to stick this one down at the bottom. So this is another very simple, easy. So my idea is to have all the same border all around. So let's see. So I'm checking this corner and this corner and it should be okay and now right here I'm gonna put with dimensionals using them all here all of my strips voila one in the back here and here I'm gonna stick this on the branch good yes I know I love these colors. Love him, love him. Okay, let's have this one whistle, whistle away. Woohoo! And then I'm taking the entire, and I'm gonna do the same trick as I did on my live the other night. Okay, saving a bit of the um, trim. So we're going to go around like so. And then we're going to go stop right there and then go back. And there. And then put this one down and done. Probably a lot of you were doing this from the beginning. I was not. So I'm excited that I can save. Okay. Well, I'm glad, Cynthia, you're watching me and say you feeling a bit better, right? So nice to see you popping on. Hopefully you were taking a little nap, right? Trying to recuperate a bit. Okay, so this is down here. Now I'm going to attach this one down. Let's see if I did a good job spacing everything out. Yeah, somewhat. Voila. And now I'm going to do a bit of... You know me and my bows. And voila. Isn't this fun? I love Baker's Twine. Love it. I know I'm going to use a ton of this stuff. A ton. Okay. And then now. This is going to be like so. Actually, if I could bring this one a bit down. I think I can. This one is going to be like so. Okay, now I need 
itty bitty dimensionals let me see if i still have some in here put them on the corners right there right here and here okay because i want them to go across my thing here stick it down okay and then what we're going to do is use these beautiful glossy dots and we're going to get these right here one and two and this card is done what do you think? I'm going to trim this one and trim a bit of this one. And voila, the card is done. The ribbon trick on your life, but it is genius. <laughs> so this is that and this is that. Okay. So this part of the Video, this video was focusing on ink colors and we used one, two, three ink colors plus the car stock plus the designer series paper to highlight the ink colors. Okay, ladies, this is all for now. Let me know if you have any questions. Hope you're, hopefully um, you learned something in this one and... I am thanking you for popping on. I will see you around 7 o'clock for the last video, the last card, and to close out the event, the party. Okay? Thank you for being here. See you soon.